It's finally time for another day trip. This time we are at Schloss Liechtenstein, which is also known as the fairy tale castle of Württemberg. Yeah, it's been a while since we went on our last day trip. And as you maybe know by now, I really love these old castles. And um, Schloss Liechtenstein is actually not too far away from um, the Burg Hohenzollern, where we went uh, the last time. And this castle here is uh, actually only our first stop this time. After that, we go to the Nebelhöhle, roughly translated as um, Fog Cave. That's um, a flowstone cave not far from here. It is around 800 meters long, but you can only walk through the cave like 400 meters or something. And you don't need a guide or anything. You can explore the cave on your own. But for now, let's go uh, to the castle. I'm already super excited to see it. Okay, we made it inside the castle and as you can see back there is the huge tower and um, the main part of the castle. This is more um, of the castle yard down there and yeah, this castle over there, it looks just um, amazing there sitting on the rocks and everything. I think that's also pretty much the first picture that you see uh, when you google the place and yeah, it looks really amazing here. With the big tower and um, the bridge going to going to the main gate, this is what a medieval castle should look like. Just like uh, the last one we've been to, it was also amazing. Angel, yeah, busy for taking uh, photos. Yeah, how do you like it? I like it very much. Looks amazing, huh? It's amazing. Looks so medieval. <laughs> yeah, it does. So, yeah, let's take a look around, enjoy the view and, I don't know, make a few photos. What a beautiful castle. It is not that super big, but it's really, yeah, beautiful. This uh, tower and uh, the main part of the castle, it looks just amazing. So if you um, just want to go inside the castle and check out the yard and so on, you have to pay two euro entrance per person and you can just walk around, make photos and so on. But if you really want, uh, if you really want to see the castle and get inside, this is only available uh, with a tour and it's like, I think, 8 euros per person. I am waiting now for Angel. She's somewhere up there. And um, then we go back to the car and move on to the cave, to the Flowstone Cave. That's around um, 5 kilometers from here, so it shouldn't take too long. Okay, quick change of plans. We um, found this beer garden here directly next uh, to the castle and we had to stop to get something to drink. Alcohol free alcohol free beer. Call down there if you want to go slide and do that. <laughs> and yeah, it's nice here. 
But when we are done with that, we uh, move on to the cave. And we are here. Yeah, the ride took only like uh, 10 minutes from the castle. And yeah, I'm super excited to see the cave. The last time I've been in a um, flowstone cave like that is like, I don't know, 10, 15 years ago. And it wasn't a really big one. And this one, I think, is a little larger than, uh, than the one I visited before. Now uh, let's try to find the entrance. And as you can see, it's pretty crowded, I guess. This cave is really amazing and at some parts it's even bigger and especially higher than expected. We are at the moment here in some sort of a hall. And yeah, it's really amazing. There are also sometimes bats flying around and I guess you don't even see me at the moment. But there's a light. Hi. So, <laughs> um, there's still so much to explore. I think we continue and move on now. I see some purple lights back there. Let's go check it out. So finally back in the daylight, but it, this cave was amazing and um, as I said before, much bigger than I expected and when you came to the end, there was this huge, huge hall with these yeah, beautiful rock formations and um, also the different lights, this, uh, the cave really impressive, it's beautiful down there and um, if you decide to visit the castle and if you are close by here, I um, definitely recommend to take the time and also visit the cave. It's not too far from the castle by car, 10 minutes or if you walk a little further, it was, I think, between three and five kilometers, so it's not that far. How did you like it? I like it very much. It's super amazing. It's a nice cave, huh? A very nice cave. So. We are somewhere in the forest now, on, our, on the way back to the car. And yeah, if you enjoyed the video, leave a like or a comment. If you want to see more of our vlogs, click on one of these videos over here and subscribe to the channel. And I'll see you guys there.